Yo guys, what's up? Roll it down here with an exciting new episode to our let's play of Alice Mare. Now, if you guys remember in the last episode, we finished up uh, the third room, which is locked. Wait, what? Oh, so it's this room. Finished up with this guy. He, um. His mother was hung. Yeah, it was it was um pretty pretty good. And, um, I recommend that you guys go check that out or start from the beginning if you guys are new here. Welcome back. Oh, your explanation, your expression, is entirely different from the last time. Ah, uh, no, I believe I understand. Well then, I'll collect all the things in from the world, and I'll put together those pages. As always, here you are. Now then, I'll open the door to the next world. I'm counting on you once more. Alright, let's, let's get into this. Oh dear Alice. What is it? Ah uh, yes, you would like to play it very well. And things fine. Yes, indeed. So I see. Shall we open the closet? It's always with the closet, guys. It's not a metaphor that I'm gay, is it? Because I'm not. I swear I'm not. Um, what? Alright. Make our way downtown. Uh, can we go this way? No, we can't. It's okay. Alright, alright. Um... Phases, fun. This kid wants to kill me. I swear to God. Oh, we go this way. No, we don't go this way. Was I right the first time? I think I was. I didn't realize it. Let's go this way. 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 God, there's a lot of tombstones here. And crosses and. Everything here. Get in my way. Get in my way. I'm not here to see ghosts. Oh. Dude, is this a tea party? Oh, Alan. You're here, Alan? Which means, I see. Ah. Uh, Thank you, teacher. This will be fine. You need to fix up your hair as well, teacher. No, I'm fine. I have no time to cut it, and I don't know how. And that means you can't? Surely you could just fumble it. No, I, I really need to know. Besides, that's not the kind of thing I'm interested in knowing now. I didn't quite catch that. It's boring standing around. Come, let's go somewhere. Alan, I'll fall behind you. I'm sure I'll, it'll be amusing whatever path you take. Stella, isn't this fine? Nothing can come of staying in the same place. What will you do, teacher? You told me to stay here because I was on my own. Yes. Well, you don't really listen to me, do you? I'll come with you. So it's settled. Well, Alan, we're counting on you. Oh, look at that, guys. We got we got Teach on us. I like how his name is, is actually just Teacher. I don't know what his true name is. He's Mad Hatter, of course. But we're going to go this way. We're just going to find a way around here. Uh, okay. <coughs> oh, God bless me. Oh, that was... <coughs> oh, God bless me. Yeah, I'm sorry, guys. Oh, what's this thing, though? I want to know. Is it going to kill me? 
Hmm. Hey, you listen. I'm a spider. I was dozing off when somebody took my legs. I can't walk like this. Can't even look for them. So you go searching for them instead. Y yo No response? Huh? Looks like a big dude back there is thinking hard. You boy! I'm counting on you. Tell me and I'll eat you. Alan, what is this bug going on about? I see his legs. I'm not doing a thing. You do it, Alan. All of it. Or else I'll have to toast you and eat you. Oh, God. That was weird. Change cannibals and stuff like that? Is there a way... Where would his legs be? Uh... Do I have to go back? I do, probably. Where are his legs? That's the true question. Wait, where are these things crawling? Oh, dig it up. Mystery legs. Bug legs. Stop it. Keep that away from me. I hate bugs. You may have a pretty face, Balan, but I suppose you're a boy. On the inside, after all. Well, I mean... So what do I have? I have mysterious leg. A bunch of legs of some kind. Well, I don't want to just go back and like give him... Do I have to dig these all up? No, I guess not. My first pick was the right pick. Wow, that's... That's kind of amazing. I feel like if this is all to it... There's a catch. There's always a catch to these kind of things. Okay. Just continue on. I guess. Got Stella and Teach with us. You know, nothing can go possibly wrong. My leg my legs. Thanks a bunch. Now put them on quick, will ya? And listen. Don't get the wrong wrong number of legs. If you mess up, I might find myself mighty hungry. That's right. I'll eat you. Capiche? How many legs does a spider have one has eight? Yeah, feels good. If you put if you put on four or six legs on me, I really would have eaten you. Alright, thanks. I'll tell you a secret place. Close your eyes. What did that book say? I see. I don't want to. I hate the dark. It's possible that he may attack us. He does seem rather rough. The hell, man? You wouldn't even speak up before. Just close them quick. Close, close, close. That was a weird typo. Unless it wasn't a typo. Let's just see what he says. Aw oh, man, you're a real lifesaver, you know. Now take a deep breath. Where are we? Where are we? Where are we? Wait, what? I'm a bit tired. Can we rest here? Just what is this place? I thought it was a dream, but it's not. I know this place, and yet I don't. I'm trying. I'm tired of walking. Yes, it's a big place. Easy to get lost. If you don't want to go any further, you two can stay here. Are you going, teach, teacher? Why? Why are you so anxious to leave, leave? To leave on your own? I don't live. I don't like people to know me, or to get them involved. I've always been that way. I see. You always have such an unhappy face, teacher. Alan, everyone. Alan, do you think you're the least happy of them all? I'm not sure. I don't have memories. Have you forgotten even how you how to feel? Perhaps you can no longer feel that you're unhappy. 
This is just what I think, but you can't compare happiness and unhappiness between people. They're both just obstacles on the path that you take. Even happiness is an obstacle? If that's so, then what do people seek? You're confusing, teacher. And don't you know the best because you're an adult? Knowing the answer is what makes you an adult. And I don't, so your teacher's still a child. I've never seen such a big, incomprehensibly blabbling child as you before. Ha. Huh. You're a harsh one, Stella. Alright, I'm fine now. Let's just proceed. I can't be sure, it, but if we move on, I feel like we're able to find something that's been troubling me. Why are you two alive, yet feel so dead? That is interesting. Alright, so this is anywhere good to stop. In the next episode, we shall continue through Stella's dream and see what is bothering her, like what was bothering the rest. As always, hit that thumbs up if you guys enjoyed. Comment down below and subscribe if you guys want more. And as always, this is Rolling Down, rolling out. See you next time.